Hello all, my name is Krishna and welcome to my YouTube channel. So guys, uh, recently you have heard of that uh, ENY will be hiring somewhere around uh, 9000 AI ML professionals, uh, you know, and uh, this was even announced in the news. Now this particular statement is pretty much important. Yes, there are going to be pretty more jobs coming from ENY specifically. And in this video, as you all know, guys, I have already worked in ENY for some period of time over there. So in this video, I'll be discussing how the interview process will be there and what all things they may probably ask, how many rounds of interview will be there and what kind of uh, salary do they offer with respect to different different positions that they have. Before going ahead with respect to this particular video, this video has been sponsored by Unacademy. So Unacademy brings you a series of free special classes to give you a detailed and structured roadmap of approaching each subject in all the branches for GATE 2022 and GATE 2023 for CS and IT. These free classes will start from 20th December where educators will introduce you about the batch agenda and guide you with a subject wise overview of the syllabus of GATE 2022 and 2023. Now here you can actually see that this also gets applied for Mechanical Engineering, CE, EE, ECE, CSIT and Chemical. Then this is the entire agenda. On the 20th you have the introduction, on 21st Digital Logics, 22nd Computer Networks, 22 Algorithms and for all the other classes you can see over here. This is specifically for CS and IT Engineering and this is for Electronics and Communication Engineering for GATE 2022 and GATE 2023. This is the entire syllabus so here you can see from 20th to 27th all the entire structure is given along with the mentor's name. So. Please do check out if you really want to know more about it. All the information is given in the description of this specific video. You know, they have like uh, different different positions like as associate consultant, uh, consultant, senior consultant and all. So similarly, this kind of jobs and basically all this work will be related with respect to AI ML where you'll be working for different different clients uh, and ENY has some amazing clients. And from the past two years that I've seen, um, there are pretty many people who are getting hired by ENY. Recently, uh, one one of my subscribers also pinged me. Uh, she was saying that she was she got hired in ENY as an associate consultant, and she'll be working in AI ML uh, projects. Uh, so this was pretty amazing news. Now coming to this, guys, uh, what and you have to take this uh, news seriously because there is definitely lot of requirements in ENY and they are hiring that are taking place what I have seen from the past one and a half years you know so how the interview process will be uh, I uh, I joined ENY you know somewhere around two years back uh, and I worked for some period of time over there and it is an amazing company they have some amazing clients uh, where you'll be providing a lot of services with respect to AI ML work uh, so the interview process was something like this. I got the call and um, you know at that time pandemic was not there. So uh, they gave me, they called me to their office for the interview. Over there uh, they gave me a problem statement which I had to solve it uh, within 30 minutes uh, and it was a pure data science problem statement. I have to create a model and it was something related to deep learning techniques and uh, i did it within 15 minutes after i completed that uh, you know then uh, my next round of interview was with the technical lead uh, who actually saw that particular problem statement and he asked questions that were related to that specific problem statement which he had actually given you so this is very much important whatever problem statement you have been given in order to solve it i was given a simple uh, deep learning problem statement uh, simple uh, image classification problem i just did not do just by creating a simple cnn i used some transfer learning techniques like resnet and all the reason i used it because uh, uh, in resnet you have some it is a very very amazing architecture where you'll be getting a lot of points to explain them and all so i went through that specific mechanism and uh, for one of my friend interview they also had given an object detection problem statement and that guy actually done uh, that particular problem statement with YOLO algorithm because he, he knew YOLO properly. So whatever problem statement they are giving, do it with a technique which you know very, very much properly. Like everything, every inch of that particular topic you should be knowing so that whenever the lead architect or lead tech, uh, 
guy who comes in for the next round you know he will if he is coming and asking you the question you should be able to answer everything and that actually strengthened my chances to get into eny after i finished the problem statement uh, within 15 minutes uh, then that guy came and he asked me a lot of questions with respect to that specific problem statement then whatever techniques that i had actually implemented he asked me everything about it how how to solve it and what all techniques are actually required in that what are the other feasible techniques that you, we can apply and all those things uh, that was related to that specific topic then there was one more round uh, in that round they asked me some general questions about ml deep learning and remember guys all those questions will be related to their specific projects or their upcoming projects so they gave me one scenario or uh, you know how you're going to solve this uh, how you're going to solve some other questions and again i'll just not specify the use cases because there are a lot of use cases that they may come up in but the main focus uh, is basically on ml and dl okay uh, if if you know computer vision and all also and again it depends on the requirements of the client over there because you will be getting hired with respect to a specific uh, 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 client itself like suppose there is one client for whom they will be probably hiring and uh, they will be probably knowing the projects that are going to come over there and with respect to that they will be asking you the questions but you have to be prepared whatever the first written test as i said is pretty much important you should be knowing about it you should the techniques that you are basically applying you should know about it. and based on that all your questions will be carry forwarded they asked me about uh, rnn lstm rnn they asked me about the architecture of rnn lstm rnn they also asked me the disadvantages of bi-directional lstm rnn they also uh, went ahead and asked me about transformers and this is this is somewhere around um, you know the basic of transformers at that time i did not know much uh, it is somewhere around one and a half year back so uh, whatever was possible i told them uh, with respect to it now if they ask me it will be something different uh, because now i know it i've implemented a lot of things with respect to that right so all these things went properly they focused more on advanced things they focused more on time series problem statement so because of which you know uh, i i was pretty much confident that i'll be getting the job uh, some more questions that they specifically asked was regarding transfer learning only not only resnet uh, they started with alexnet then I, we went to vg16 then we went to some higher things like resnet and all you know over there and they also asked me about mobile net when to use it when not to use it and all so all the different different kind of scenarios they were juggling here and there and where they were trying to combine multiple topics trying to understand the advantages and disadvantages of that uh, it went in that specific way the interview was very very much good uh, the person who was interviewing he was also knowledgeable uh, he was having a lot of knowledge with respect to that now like this uh, so first was the written test and again two more rounds uh, these two rounds went uh, till somewhere around uh, one hour 15 minutes which, which i was seeing the time the next round was about the uh, uh, was with the director itself a director of that specific uh, ai ml group itself and there uh, they he specifically focused more on use cases what kind of use cases you have solved in your previous companies and all and uh, he was pretty much interested to understand which all domains you have actually worked because understand for a specific client they'll only not be working in one project there will be multiple projects uh, in in eny and they have some very good clients guys trust me eny has very good clients um and I've seen that. I've seen that it's an amazing company altogether, you know. And uh, you also get paid very nicely when compared to the market, at least more than the market uh, way that you'll be getting paid. Now, how to apply to ENY? There are various ways, guys. First of all, if you have any of your friends working in ENY, just tell them that whenever there is a referral, you just tell them to upload your resume. Because through the referral technique, uh, the hiring will be happening very, very quickly okay very 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 quickly in e eny so any of your friends who are actually working in eny just tell them that whenever the requirement comes in the portal just upload your resume over there or try to contact or try to provide the, your referral quickly as possible so that they can call you for the interview i gave referral for one of my friend okay uh, uh, uh i gave a referral for one of my friend and he was just hired it another three days you know so uh, they asked me whether i had any referrals or not uh, so i told okay uh, i have one of my friend who wants to work over here i just gave the resume the next day the interview was conducted and just in one day he was got hired and couple of days he got the offer letter also so that is how quickly uh, you know the referral techniques will actually work 
so if you have many of your friends or you just try to contact someone in linkedin and all who are working in eny on uh, ai ml they will definitely be help you, uh, able to help you out and this process will happen very very quickly this is the best possible way the second thing is that try to see in linkedin uh, a lot of requirements will be coming keep on applying it and all but trust me the first technique if you have some of the friends who are working in ny it will be very very beneficial for you and again now coming to the salary part uh, salary is pretty much good uh, at least uh, as i tell you right based on the market i'll not just say you the exact term how much i got over there but uh, with respect to the years of experience more than three times is feasible you will be getting uh, suppose if you have four four years of experience at least you will be getting more than 12 lakhs uh, in up or annum apart from that they also give you some more benefits even though when you are working in client side they'll give you they'll pay you extra money your telephone bill will be uh, covered up your wifi bill internet bill will be covered up right now it's a pandemic situation everybody is working from home this all things will be covered up and even though when you are working with the client it will be covered up your wifi bills telephone bills uh, your traveling to the client office will also be covered up monthly you'll be getting some remuneration for that so and in short uh, eny yes i had a lot of fun working over there and it was pretty much amazing i still have some of my good friends over working over there itself for whom i met earlier when i was working over there but it is pretty much amazing and the kind of work you will be getting is pretty much good right so i hope i have given a brief idea about it and i hope you have understood it so this is all about this particular video i hope you like it please do subscribe to the channel if you are not already subscribed i'll see you in the next video have a great day thank you one and all bye bye